Okay, clear prop. starting to go down. You can see the shade from the mountains or the hills. Got all the strobes on. Starting to get cold. Got a pretty thick jacket on. My nose is running. That's a sign of cold. <laughs> okay. Cold nose, warm heart. 32 miles an hour. Still a little better with a warmer jacket on. I'm going to open up the trip a little bit. Just to well. About nine. Okay. David's probably wondering what the heck am I doing. He was over here back behind me. Stood about 34 miles an hour. Sundown is uh, around 8, about 10. Let's see what it is. It's, uh, sundown is at 8.03. So in about uh, 10 minutes or so, the sun will be down. It's 7.15. So about 13 minutes, the sun will be down. We've got 30 minutes after that with uh, strobes. But because it gets so damp, we don't want to wait too late. Go out there and get wet wings. About 36 miles an hour. Turn around and take a look at the sunset. Yeah, it's still up there pretty tall. Thirty-eight, thirty-seven miles an hour, three hundred and eighty-five feet. David's way up above you. If you can see my mirror, you can see it between my wings. This weekend, Saturday is the first Ohio State Buckeye game, and uh, I am a Buckeye uh, fan, and uh, I'll stay at home and watch the Buckeyes before I'll go fly. I really enjoy watching them. I'm hoping they have a good season this year. Here's a few other teams I like. College ball mostly. But I will watch the Browns and the Bengals being from Ohio.
we're going to turn into the sun and fly back into the sunset. And if the hurricane stays south and doesn't come up towards Ohio, usually we'll get a little bit off of it. We might get a couple nice days coming up. to the wind about 90 miles an hour now. Got some high power lines down to the right. Airport is about 2.7 miles straight ahead. Got to pull the trips in. One thing about having the trims out as far as I did, you had to keep up your RPMs to keep up your altitude. And okay, we're on six. So that's pretty good. I'll land at six. That sun is Looking really nice straight ahead. It's seven fifty nine. It's nice and smooth. Let off of the the brakes. Just uh, flying pretty straight. I was thinking about putting a couple knots in my torque line so that I can kind of uh, adjust it a couple different slots. It's just about to go down. It's 8.01 right now. There it goes. And we're on our final straight ahead. Slowly dropping, 390, 380, 22 miles an hour. Been flying for about 14 minutes on this flight.
so we're going to have to start coming out here earlier and earlier to get into a flight as it's going to start getting darker and darker but we uh, or well I normally will fly till November or the end of November and uh, David he's a little cold hardy he'll fly a little bit longer and I'll fly December or January I'll fly you know if it gets warm enough above 50 and sunny and not all slop and muddy uh, out on the field I'll fly slowly dropping in did about seven miles on this flight want to get the wing off the ground as it'll be fairly wet there's a little bounce Okay, grab a hold of both brakes and start taking our way down. It's a little smoother up there than it is down here. Pull a little break here, just get a little lift to hold me up. Fly a little fuel. And touch down and hit the power and turn around this curve here and see if I can. <laughs> Pretty close. 